Look at me. I look like... <laughs> I've no water in my house. Some of the plugs aren't working. The ice in my coffee <laughs> smelting. I don't know, there's something wrong. There's something really wrong with this angle. Look at my socks. So funny story about this t-shirt. This was the same t-shirt that I tie-dyed in grade eight. So it's Sunday. Sunday. Sunday fun day. <laughs> Saturday fun day. My hair looks unbrushed, but you guys don't get it. Like you've seen me sort of at my lowest, my absolute lowest. I was gonna film a video yesterday. So I was gonna film a video on Saturday. I was like, time to film, time to get everything in order beats. Time to do my thing. I was like, um. Yesterday, yesterday happened and I was like, time to film, film a time. As I was saying, Friday, no. I wasn't starting with Friday. Saturday, I was gonna film. I was gonna film a nice little video. Came up with ideas. I was like, these are the ideas. Two minutes later, I was like, I actually hate those ideas. Those ideas suck. I don't wanna do that. And then I had a breakdown and then, yeah. But then today, today I woke up and I was like, yes. Let's do it, memes. I woke up to having no water in my house. Oh, some of the plugs. Some of my plugs aren't working. And now the ice in my coffee is melting. So it's like you win some, you lose some. In this case, I'm losing it all. <laughs> but anyways, that's not why you're here. You're here to hear about part two of UCT Week Babes. Orientation week at University of Deep Down Babes. So if you haven't watched part two, no. If you haven't part one, <laughs> if you haven't watched part one of UCT Orientation Week Babes, my experience, part one. You can click here or you can click here. Yeah, but this is part two. So if you if you want to hear about the stories, the things, the experience, stay tuned, babes. Stay tuned. I had Plaza Day. Plaza Day, babes. Let me tell you what that's for. Plaza Day. So basically, what Plaza Day? Plaza Week. It's actually one day. I don't know why it was Plaza Week. Someone talked about that, and I was like, but it's one day. Plaza Day is a day from 9 to 4 or 5 p.m. where they showcase all of the different clubs, the societies, the sports, the works. They're showcasing Alice, everything babes. Yeah, there was music, there's snacks. No. Yes? Maybe. So let me start chronologically, love. So I got to the campus. No! At my campus tour as well. So I was like doing my campus tour from 9 to 10. Right, right, babes. I was doing my campus tour. We went around. It was like a group. We were five in the group. I made new friends. New friends. I kind of forgot their names, but it was fun. You know, the campus tour was a moment. I went with some of my friends, two of my friends. One of them I met on the day and I was like, you and I, we are inseparable. But then we took a tour. We went around the places. We did our thing. I forgot all the building's names, but the library babes. I don't read. Oh. But when I tell you I'm gonna be in the library for no good reason, babes. So then it was like a building. And then there was like a 24-hour business. You can stay there overnight. Like sleep over, babes. No, it's not like that. I don't know why I'm taking this to town. It's literally the library. <laughs> anyways, anyways, anyways. And then we had the campus tour. Right, that was done. That was finished. I won a prize, actually. I won a free pair of earphones from the, the little tech store. I also won a bottle. A 2019 orientation program. UCT water bottle. Plastic. There was a, this looked like a psychiatric ward. Not even like, uh, like the normal, like this looked scary, like the Joker is sitting behind the door. You walk out of the library and then you go to the left and you get get big dick, you get standard bank, you get all the banks, the ATMs, right? And then there's like an alley, but it's like all lit up, but it's like a plain peach color. You know that hospital ward? I beat like the orientation with leader was like we don't suggest you use these bathrooms I was like no I can see like who would come all the way here to use these ones babes these ones but then we walked around we got the snake building the CC ghoul the CZ ghoul John Day Steve Beagle Leslie Neville Alexander who are these people and maybe I should do some research I want a building named after me I mean I I I think I need a building named after me. That'd be so, like, Brooklyn. Go to the Brooklyn building, babes. But yeah, we had a campus tour. Right, that was done. Then we had to go and see our orientation leader. We met our orientation leader. She was so cool. I loved her. So then we met our orientation leader. She gave us activities, which I was, like, sort of waiting for. Like, this is... 
because like so far with orientation up to this point it was mainly just instructional and informational activities i was waiting on like the <coughs> the group activities interact like that sort of yes you know what i'm saying and then she sort of Added a little bit of spice, a little bit of sugar. As soon as we left, all of it dissolved in the water, babes. It was finished, it was done. But then we had like fun. She told us to mingle with new people, introduce them to the whole group. I was speaking to this guy, right? And we were, he was basically telling me where he was from, what he was studying, and a cool fact about him, right? So he told me he plays the guitar. And I was like, oh, that's so cool. How long have you been playing? And then we had to, obviously I had to do the same about myself. I had to tell my name, what I'm studying, where I'm from. Cool fact about me, right? This is what I said. This is what I said. I'm Brooklyn. My name's Brooklyn. I'm studying Bachelor of Business Science in Finance with Accounting. I'm from Cape Town. And a fun fact about me is I actually play the guitar, violin, piano, recorder. I can sing and I can dance a lot, so. I didn't realize what I did until after the moment. I was like, oh, I didn't just one up. I quadrupled up this man. Like, I was like, that was the most douchebag thing I've ever ever <laughs> Smells like shame. No, that was like horrible. Why did I do that? But I was like feeling it in the moment as well. I could have said anything in the world. Anything in the world. So yeah, then we were done with that. Then we had to go to the Plaza Day, you know, the busy day, which was down on the rugby field, right? We walked past all the clubs and societies and and we were being shown everything. I put my name and phone number down for athletics, tennis, and entrepreneurs society. So maybe I am the main. Then I was like, I wanna go home now. So <laughs> I gone. Then I get an email, I think the next day or of like that day. So then I get an email, either the Wednesday or the Thursday, and they're like, the commerce faculty is planning this amazing race, babes, you better show up. I was excited, I was like texting my friends and I was like, wait, this is like exciting. I'm excited because it's, it's bringing the chaos that I wanted. On the next day, actually, on the day of the race, UCT emails us and they're like, no. No, 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 no. There's protests, so no one can come on campus. And I'm like, okay. So then UCT was like, no, we're actually hosting an online race. And I was like, I'm not gonna take part in your voodoo magic, babes. I don't wanna do that. Cause I was gonna come to campus. I was gonna run. I was gonna do my thing, make a team. We were gonna win. Now we are winning, but on a WhatsApp group. How does that work, babes? How does that work? How does that work? And then that day, orientation week ended. Like, a week was done, finished. And the next Monday, we were starting with classes, right? I was thinking, you know, I'm I'm ready. Classes took place this week. Monday started, babes. Information overload. Information overload. To the mix, babes. So I was going insane. I was losing the plot, really. Monday was probably my worst day I've ever had in my entire life. It was information overload. There was already a lot of work that I felt already behind on. It was day one and it was all online. <laughs> so let me just sit here. You guys, you guys don't mind. All right, let's just sing. All right, babes, so Monday started. Monday. No. Keep in mind the protests, the protests. Let's not forget the protests. Tuesday comes, it's still, it's the same as Monday. You know, at this point, I'm just trying to get through the week. Monday and Tuesday were like this. I was beat down to the, to the soil, babe. To the soil. The roots. And to think, to think. Let's just get this straight. To think that it is Black History Month. My mother, she's a black woman. Why am I being tortured, babes? By the academics, no. Ooh, make it make sense. Wednesday came, I was like, yeah. Today we're chilling. <laughs> Today which are like, like Thursday. Thursday was whatever as well. Friday was oh Friday I was like I'm actually not in the mood to work. And then I went to the mall, I uploaded a video. You can go watch that. But it wasn't really like any fun throughout the week. So all in all, this is not like what I thought it would be. <laughs> I thought it was gonna be like a bit more fun, a bit more like university installed fun events for first years. Like I thought a bit more of that was gonna go on. I guess we'll just have to see in the next few days, weeks, how it goes. I'm staying on top of the work and I'm one. Which I was like, wait. <laughs> That's what's so nice about university is that it's like your own, like you organize all your own things. I kind of am winning though. But yeah, that's sort of been my experience, my part two. If there's any first years out there, first years at UCT, Stellies, wherever you are, put your comments, put your experiences down below. I'm gonna read them all. But yeah, that's sort of, that's me. That's me, babes! That's me! But thank you so much for listening to me. Thank you so much for hanging out with me, my best friend. It's been a real one. And I will see you on the next, on the next one. I love you guys so much. I hope you're staying safe. I hope you're wearing the mask. I hope you're getting mixed meats. You know what I'm saying? I love you so much and I'll see you on the next one.